I've been urged the last few days to share some angel messages with you. They just kind of wanted to give everybody a collective hug because I know there's, I, there are a lot of people out there hurting right now for a lot of different reasons. Hey folks, it's Susan at the Rock Shop at 311 Broadway, Historic, downtown Paducah, where positive energy works. So I wanted to share a couple of messages. I'm going to pick a couple random pages out of a little angel message book that I wrote. Oh gosh, it must have been 20 years ago. So let's get started because I know that somebody out there needs this message. So the way this works is I just pick a random page and that's the message that either I need, I always need an angel message, but also I know that it's going to resonate with somebody out there. Okay, so let's just pick a page. All right, here we go. Challenges disappear when we clear our consciousness of the issue that they represent. Oh boy. Yeah. Boy, isn't that the truth? You know, how many times have we gotten stuck in a life lesson that just keeps like an endless loop, you know, circling back around and it's the same argument. It's the same set of circumstances, a different day and, and cranked a quarter of a turn, but we just, we keep having to face the same self issues. It's a real incentive to learn that lesson so that you can move on. <laughs> There's a lot of things that uh, I know all of us continue to get the same lesson over and over. Let's see what else they got to say here. All right. Creativity is a new way of seeing what already exists. Yeah. So I know a lot of us are feeling real stuck right now, you know, stuck. How do we get through this global pandemic? How do we get through some of these stuck relationships with, with people who don't have the same worldview? How do we get past and, and unstuck in our professional and in our prosperity and in our personal relationships? How do we get that? And it's going to take some creativity and seeing the solution is already there. We just have to see it in a new creative light. Creativity is a new way of seeing what already exists. And I think in some ways what you have to do is you have to put down your pre-existing and then, you know, blink hard and then see things new and, and fresh. Good message. I think one more. What do you think? One more. Okay. One more. Oh boy. Okay. We attract what we give our energy to. And by energy, I mean what we speak about, what we think about, what we feel about, what we actually give action to. So whatever it is that we're focusing on, we're going to get more of it in our life. And the angels have reminded me many times, if you're not liking what you're seeing and manifesting in your life, focus on something other than that. I know that's always, uh, that's always great advice. It isn't always the easiest to follow, is it? Yeah. Well, there's a couple messages just flat out uh, from the angels today. I don't know about you, but I've been needing some angel hugs lately. Um, you know, earth school can be a little bit rocky sometimes. So never forget you are not alone and they continue to remind us, call on the, the holy archangels, just get yourself quiet and pray or meditate or do whatever you need to do to get centered reach to the divine, ask for any and all who come, come from the highest for, source for your highest good and the highest good of all, but call on your angels. They don't want you to be alone. They want to come and help you, but they cannot intervene unless you ask and invite them in. So ask them to come and to be a part of your world, be filled with gratitude and and use that enormous divine resource that is available to you. I hope those messages helped. This is Susan at the Rock Shop at 311 Broadway, historic downtown Paducah. Please hit that like button and subscribe. We do appreciate your support. Have a very, very good day.